At this festival, there are rides, music, Miami, Miami, and food. Lots and lots of food. We have barbecue nachos, we have hamburgers, cheeseburgers. Um, we also have some desserts like fried Oreos, fried Twinkies, and fried cupcakes. Pork chop on a stick. For more than three decades now, Amory's Railroad Festival has drawn crowds to Frisco Park and revenue to vendors and the region. The celebration also gives back to the community in a big way. Most vendors at the food court are nonprofits and are able to use proceeds to fund a variety of projects and outreaches. We're going to do different things from missions given to uh, church renovation projects. Caledonia UPC hopes to sell more than 1,500 pounds of crawfish at the festival. Next door, Trace Road Baptist Church members are fielding funnel cake orders. We're innovators. Now this year we're introducing our, our new funnel cake dispenser. We have a machine that pumps the funnel cake dough through a specialized gun uh, that we can squirt it right into the grease and make a funnel cake. Each festival goer has a favorite food. The funnel cakes, hamburgers, french fries, potato fries. The, the deep fried Reese's I'm eating now. But hands down, the most popular festival food is... The apple fritters. Bethel Apostolic Church members started frying up the fritters 32 years ago. You just can't eat one. You have to come back for more, you know. The Bethel workers even have their own theme song. If an apple a day keeps a doctor away, think what a fritter will do. A couple of tips if you plan on visiting the festival. First of all, don't eat before you come. Wear comfortable shoes and be prepared to spend several hours out here. As many as 60,000 people could visit through the weekend. In Amory, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.